morning guys i am rushing off to a pt session so i'm just quickly saying hi hello it was rushed again this morning so i didn't get a chance to start the vlog this morning i've been running around like a headless chicken trying to get things done there's just too much to do this week my pt sessions have been the only thing that i've done once a week for the last few weeks i've not i've not had time to do much slash my classes haven't met up with my timetable slash i've just not really been that interested in going to the gym so once a week is better than nothing for those of you who are interested in seeing some bits that i've been doing i will film a couple of snippets feel free to skip as you can imagine life's been a little bit hectic the last week with my mum being in hospital thank you for all your kind um kind and well wishes on instagram kind and well wishes that's not a thing is it your well wishes your kind wishes your nice messages thank you for your nice messages she's getting there she's getting better um she should be coming out in a couple of days i'm vlogging today because today's going to be my least busiest day of the week so that's why i'm filming today anyway let's go I'm vlogging. <laughs> I know Jamie's not used to me actually talking to the camera. I think this is probably going to kill me this one. Did some uh, chest presses or whatever they're called. Did some stuff on there. Now Jamie's sitting up doing some cool stuff. It's got me doing ropes. I don't like ropes. Two, one, and let's go. everything. I've only filmed about half of our session and then everything you see we do three or four times over. My arms are killing me but that was good. This makes me so excited. Look at all these leaves. I feel like autumn's come a little bit early this year. I could be wrong but I love it. Just picking up a really quick and easy lunch and then loads of fruit for Delilah because she is a little fruit monster. <laughs> Home and extremely windswept. Oh, it's very windy out there today. I'm feeling tons better for a workout. If I'm honest, I've not been having a great week mentally. I've just really struggled, and it's like my anxiety's been fine. But there's like another thing. There's another thing that I struggle with, and I can't explain it. But all of a sudden, something will switch, and my mood will be really low. Um, even if I'm not feeling anxious, like I felt fine last week, but my mood on, I don't know, if, if, like five days or so ago, I had a day where I just, I have these days where I just, um, I almost like zone out, I space out. I feel like I'm in a dream and I'm kind of going slow motion and everything's happening around me and I'm not really there. It was really strange and if you don't have weird days like that then you probably have no idea what i'm talking about and i've struggled with that a lot this week and i've been feeling quite down and yeah i don't know but i guess i just wanted to give you some background on what my week's been like because today feels like a good day and i think it's probably partly or a lot to do with the fact that i've fitted in a workout i really need to start even if i don't feel like it start making myself go back to my classes and back to regular workouts because my word it helps so much like right now i'm feeling good i'm feeling positive i positive i feel like i'm going to be productive now and get a lot crammed into the next couple of hours that i have to do some work i'm gonna have some lunch now because i'm very hungry myself up this um, edamame and black rice 
nourish bowl from Marks and Sparks because I really don't have the brain power to be thinking about what to, what to eat for lunch. I know, super lazy of me. Giving myself 15 minutes to eat this whilst I catch up on the Michelax. Got my iced coffee. This table is a mess. <laughs> I need to sort it out. Um, there are briefs everywhere from work I've got going on. Um, yeah, I should probably be careful what I show you. You may be able to see that I now have both my computers out again because I needed to get some content from my old computer. Um, it's a long story. I need to find the time um, when things calm down a little bit, maybe next month, to completely clear and get everything off my old computer so that I can sell it. I don't know where to put you guys. Let's put you... Ah, there we go. My camera is holding on by a thread, quite literally. Camera lens is just flapping around everywhere. I've got bits of tape holding it together. And every time it goes out of, like, out of alignment, I then get flipped upside down in the viewfinder. It's very annoying. I have a lot to cram into the next hour. I need to send an amendment for some sponsored content. I need to do some emails. I then need to get showered, changed, pack some snacks and bits and bobs for Delilah because I'm going to collect her from the childminders early today because we've got a mummy daughter date to the theatre. I booked us tickets to go see Bing. Delilah's been to the theatre a couple of times but we've never gone to see her and it's going to feel like a bit of a treat as well because we're going late afternoon. I think she'll love it and then we might get some ice cream in the break. I say might, we'll definitely get some ice cream. And I'm just really looking forward to, um, to spending time with her, just me and her. I need to book a taxi actually, so I'm going to do that now. Could I book a taxi for half past three? They said it's a very tricky time to book a taxi and so it could be delayed. So I've booked it for earlier than, I, than we need to. we will be all right. We should be there on time. Camera is falling apart. It's flapping around all over the place. Oh, it's really dying on me. I've had some last minute brand deals come in, which is amazing, but it's not really the right time and they're really tight deadlines. I'm just going to, I'm just going to hold you guys because my screen's flapping around everywhere. Yes. Yeah, so this month, I knew my mum was going into hospital and it worked out quite well because I'm not doing vloggist or vlogtober so in that sense at least I'm not doing that on top of some on top of branded work and caring for my mum and doing visits and, and bits and bobs but at the same time about three yeah three brands got hold of me which were all perfect and so in fitting for um, my Instagram and YouTube and all brands I would love to work with so I couldn't say no and obviously and, and it's I only say no if it's a brand that I don't want to work with. You have to take, you know, you have to take what's offered to you if it's good for you and you would like to do it even sometimes when it's not on the best best of times because then I could go another couple months without any sponsorship and they're, you know, they're the things that really pay well. It's, it's, it's a busy week but I'm, I feel really fortunate for these um, brand deals that have come in and I just really, really hope that it doesn't pee people off too much because I, I fully appreciate that I've uploaded a lot of sponsored content on my Instagram recently. I went off on a bit of a tangent there. Oh my gosh, this desk is just ridiculous. I don't have time to clear it. <laughs> Let's get this stuff done super duper quick. So I'll catch up with you guys in a little bit. I am all showered and changed. I have changed my top. I just have a couple of these. Got a nice clean one on. I'm probably just gonna whack a jumper over the top. And then got the blue jeans on. I've not worn these for ages. I've been um, living in my black straight leg jeans. Um, do you remember, I spent years in skinny, like really skinny jeans. And now, like since I started wearing mum jeans and straight leg jeans, I cannot wear skinny, skinny jeans. I'm just cutting up some grapes for Delilah. I'm gonna take those with us. We've got our tickets, fruit. We're doing well for time, guys, we're doing well. I've been wearing this one a lot recently. Um, it's from, it's from People Tree been getting asked lots of questions about it i literally like quite literally got the last one that they had in stock um hence why i got a medium but actually it comes up fairly small like, i feel like for a medium it's quite small still not quite cold enough for my acne so we'll just go for this this one again 
it's actual scarf and boots weather um this week which is just so exciting how many times can Rianne say she's excited for autumn got a few minutes until i need to leave so eat gonna bung some washing in all done did you have a nice day today bubba Oh, and off she goes. <laughs> Did it. You want some fruit? Yes. There we go. Go. Good job. I purposely saved some um, some lentil bolognese that I cooked a couple of nights ago. If you want the recipe, it's on my Instagram highlights on my profile. Made myself up some too because um, I'm I don't know. I'm either going to have this now or I'm going to take it to the hospital later. And then Delilah's got some sauce to go with some freshly cooked pasta now. Hello. I'm gonna heat up my dinner now and have it with Delilah. Mm. Yeah. Oh, I can't wait until we can actually sit at a dining room table. I know we have that one, but <laughs> clearly it's been taken over by my um, computer and work stuff. But also Delilah's high chair never never fitted onto like under the table, so it was never gonna work. Dinner. Well, dinner on the floor for me is. Delilah's okay, because she's got a little uh, table and chairs. I'm just gonna have to sit on the floor. It's quite nice to have dinner together though. Today is testing me. 
or something. I'm having a good day. But I'm also just doing stupid stuff like that. Oh, it just, it just like fell. I don't know what happened. Let's try that again. I basically just wiped it up with um, one of my bamboo reusable kitchen roll cloth. Then I won't need to use any detergent when I wash those in the morning. There's a positive for everything. That's washing on. Let's clean this up. I also forgot to mention that Delilah spilled her almond milk. She's usually really good with it. Um, but today it somehow ended up all over the bottom of the TV and on top of the TV unit and all down the back of the TV. So had to clean that up and then I've just <laughs> spilled washing detergent everywhere. She made such a mess with dinner. Dog home. Delilah's about to have her bath. <laughs> <laughs> This is my cue to uh, to sneak out um, and Doug will put her to bed. And I'm going to make my way to the hospital to see my mum. This has been my routine most nights since my mum went in this time last week. She's, so she's been in for a week now. I've been going in some days as well as evenings and some days I've been taking Delilah with me. Taking my keep cup because there is a hot chocolate and coffee machine in the waiting area and it's free so I take my keep cup and get myself a hot chocky in the evenings I am walking home now it's about a half ten it's a little bit earlier than what I usually um leave it's, was that a sentence? <laughs> I love walking home at this time of night or really early in the morning because it's just so quiet which is one reason why I don't like to have my headphones in at this time because I like to be able to listen to the peace and quiet but also it just freaks me out not being able to hear I like to be able to <laughs> grab my bearings a little bit and hear if there's anyone around me I mean it's a pretty safe town but you never know. Anyway, when I get in, I need to be super duper quiet so I don't wake Delilah up. Um, Doug's actually still up, which is nice because he's, he's usually in bed asleep by the time I get home. So I get to see him quickly before we go to bed. I'm going to bed now. Doug's still watching a film. I've got my second driving lesson tomorrow. I didn't have one last week because I had so much to do. I just I had to reschedule it so it's been a couple of weeks since I had my um, first driving lesson so I've got my second tomorrow not gonna lie not really looking forward to it but it's gotta be done I hope you're all well and I will see you in my next vlog